welcome to the pack. Streaker 6 here, and I was watching Casmo for a second time explain uh, how to bring your Apache helicopter into a stable stop and hover from forward movement. I think he Casmo is awesome. He is great. He is my go-to guy for learning anything about any one of these helicopters that are in DCS. Um, but I think what he's not doing for you guys that are asking is he's not going high speed enough for high enough speed for you. And I know he said, it, I'm pretty sure it was Casmo that had said uh, that helicopters are always deliberate and slow. You want to go deliberate and slow. You don't want to do the these high speed stops and maneuvers like that because uh, it's just dangerous. But being in a video game or flight simulator as, as it really what it really is, but uh, Everybody wants to push everything to the boundaries because you have no risk of injury or death to anyone So that's a good thing and it's kind of fun and kind of cool anyway, so Basically what you need to do is you just take Casmo's uh, Fundamentals that he has in his videos, which I'm gonna have linked in the description below and you use his fundamentals for the slower speeds and you just kind of enhance it more. A lot of times what you're going to want to do is you're, wanna, you're going to want to spin your bird to the right or the left depending on what you're comfortable with or what the situation is to help slow you down without making you pop up so much because uh, these helicopters have a great tendency to shoot straight up in the air when you're pulling back on this on the cyclic and pushing down on the uh collective uh to come to a quick stop like that so um with that being said another thing that i never do is i don't use trim at all ever uh for some reason it always just messes with me uh and I think when you're, I'm thinking that when you're going for a high speed stop like that, that it's gonna mess with you if you're gonna try going for a high speed stop when you have your trim on because your stick, your centering of your stick is gonna be set in different positions so you're not gonna have the full throw of the stick when you are trying to come to that stop. So basically what I'm doing here is I'm looking for a good spot for me to uh, basically come to a quick stop for you. Uh, and I forgot to mention, you know, you saw me flying around the airfield like that. I do that on the caucuses for practice for high speed maneuvering uh, to try to stay inside the taxiways like that at the highest rate that I can go. It, it builds my skills just for even regular flight. So um, I'll try and stop by right at the tree line here without going through it. I may or may not die, um, but it just happens. Um, so basically use Casmo's fundamentals and practice. You just bring your bird in and spin in it. Spinning it. Oh, 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 I'm gonna die. I'm gonna have to. Oh, I pulled out of it. But you get, you get my point here. I should have died in any regular helicopter. For some reason, the Apache is actually pretty tough when it comes to doing stuff like that. Um, I'll give it one more attempt. I usually will come in pretty stable. I mean, as stable as you're gonna get. You're gonna be kind of all over the place regardless. So I must have damaged some stuff. I'm really pulling to the, really dumping to the side, but that's okay. I 
we'll uh, attempt this one more time for you guys. Just to show you, yep, it can be done. Yep, and I'm always over torquing and all that other stuff too. It's just the nature of the beast with this thing. Um, for me at least. So, basically here I am again, coming up. Might be the video recording that, you know, getting kind of kind of messing with me here but we'll see and then you bring yourself into a hover not the prettiest thing but just showing you it can be done and let's see they're close enough shows you it can be done and uh kind of more so what you guys are looking for I think but like I say it's just all practice and using Casmo's fundamentals um, and I, I I'm pretty sure I'm right with the trim on you're gonna be losing a lot of your throw in your cyclic so I would suggest if you're gonna attempt things like this to have your trim off and uh, if you found this video useful you, you know the drill thanks for watching